Hey guys, my name is Aubrey and I am currently a student in Sunway University. I am doing my diploma in performing arts and I've been an intern here at Media Sire for almost three months now. So now I'm going to tell you all about my experience in Media Sire. So in the past three months, I have worked on 22 videos and here they are. My first video was about haze. This video was about the do's and the don'ts during a very bad haze and also informing the public about the API readings. This is also the first time I acted or hosted something in front of a camera. I got to attend a number of events while I was here at Media Sire. The first event I edited and covered was the DH launch which was a launching of an anti-aging product. This was one of the first videos I edited. The second video I edited was the Archidex exhibition, which I also shot with my teammate in KLCC this year. I made six videos from the Archidex exhibition, five of which were interviews with artists, interior designers, sales managers, and assistant managers of companies. In Media Sire, we are given assignments as interns and each of us have to come up with a minimum of three episodes of our own mini-series. So for my mini-series, which I entitled Young at Art, was about young people from the age of 18 to 21 years old who are really talented and who put their talents to good use and some of them have become famous. The first episode of my mini-series was about Irvin Sue, a 20-year-old clown and magician who performs and who entertains people even for free when they can't afford it. The second episode was about Sunway Dance Club and I interviewed them about their new and their first dance production called Genesis, which was also for charity. The third was about a rapper, Harvin Skin, who's also 20 years old and he is currently upcoming and coming up with his own singles and he talks about how he handles rapping and studying and all these trolls on YouTube. I have also done one minute news updates where it is done against a blue screen and I talk about the latest news or what's trending. The first one I did was about the hashtag July Wish trending on Twitter, about football and also about our websites hacked by Bangladeshis. The second one I did was about Metallica coming to KL. The third one I did was about the death of Glee's very own Corey Monteith, which was pretty sad. We also work as a team here in Media Sire, so I would help my teammates with their shoots and they would help me with mine. We would also go on most of the shoots together. For Hari Raya, we went to Bukit Bintang and we interviewed pedestrians about how their Ramadan was and how their Raya is going to be and how they're planning on celebrating it. I shot and interviewed some of them. It was quite hard getting people to you know, talk to you, but at the end of the day, we got a number that sufficed. On the same day, we shot Eugene Yeo playing his violin in different places in Bukit Bintang and he was playing the Saloka Hari Raya. I helped my teammate with his third episode of his own mini-series, Unique Taste of Malaysia and we went to a Malacca Portuguese restaurant in Bangsa South and the food was simply yummy. I co-hosted it and I also shot some of the cutaways for the interview. The last two videos that I have done was an Airsoft East Coast promo. Airsoft is a game similar to paintball but instead of paint bullets they use round hard plastic bullets and it is really painful if you don't gear up. I did the promo video for a company in Kuantan that is involved in holding events and shootouts. I also covered both the events and I shot both the promo and the two events by myself and also edited it. Throughout my three months here, I can say that I have learned a lot. I have learned how to use Adobe Premiere, which I never knew how to use before. 
I have learned a lot on how to improve my camera work. I have learned how to adapt to different environments and to different people and I have learned how to communicate really well. Back in college, I have been so used to short films and here we cover live events where there's no proper planning, there's no proper storyboard and it really teaches you how to be spontaneous and I have learned a lot throughout my internship here. And that's all guys. Thanks. Bye.